to. The mother of Mary, Hannah, was at one time a barren woman who longed for a child. She made a vow to God that if he gifted her with a child, that she would consecrate him to his service in the holiest of all temples, the Temple of Solomon, to be a scholar or a priest. God answered her prayers and gifted her with a girl child. Hannah was a bit saddened at the child's gender, as usually only male children were given in service. Yet in accordance with her promise to God, she instructed that Mary is raised at the temple by her uncle Zechariah, Zechariah in Arabic, who was a prophet of God. As Mary got older, prophet Zechariah would visit her in her chamber at the temple, where only he had access and he would observe that she feast on the best of foods and cold drinks. He would ask as to who had delivered these feasts when no one else had the keys to the chamber. She then would respond, Allah, she was blessed by miracles of God, even prior to the birth of Jesus Christ. According to the Holy Quran, Angel Gabriel walked into Mary's chamber. Terrified that someone had come to harm her or to remove her chastity, she cried out, I seek refuge from Allah. Angel Gabriel responded, I am not an enemy, I am Allah's servant and the messenger who came to deliver glad tidings to you, that Allah would bestow upon you a child. She replied, How can I have a child if I don't have a husband and no man has touched me? Angel Gabriel then responded, Allah creates that what he wills. If he decrees a thing, he says unto it, Be, and it is. Quran 3.47 Jesus Christ was conceived with the word kun, which means be. He did not become the embodiment of the word kun, like Christians mistakenly believe. Rather, his existence was elicited by the word kun. Jesus' real name is Esau. The Latin name Jesus was given by the Christians of the West. The letter J does not actually exist in Aramaic. So Jesus himself would not recognize the name Jesus. Mary gave birth to Jesus in the valley of Bethlehem, away from the people, after which she then returned. The Quran confirms that Jesus was born of a virgin woman. When they saw her with newborn child Jesus, they said, O Mary, you have certainly done a strange thing. O sister of Aaron, your father was not a man of evil, nor was your mother unchaste. Quran 19, 27-28 Mary didn't speak, but instead pointed at her child. So she pointed to him, they said, How can we speak to one who is in the cradle, a child? Jesus said, Indeed, I am the servant of Allah. He has given me the scripture and made me a prophet and he has made me blessed wherever I am and has enjoyed upon me prayer and zakah as long as I remain alive and made me dutiful to my mother and he has not made me a wretched tyrant and peace is on me the day I was born and the day I will die and the day I am raised alive. Quran 29.33 The Quran references the miracles that Jesus performed by the power and the will of God even in his infancy when he spoke in the cradle to defend his mom's chastity and innocence.